Steve, what's the game plan for the Spaniards? Well, they're going to have to find a way to contain Kobe more. I think you have to deny him the ball all over the floor. And when he does get it, as soon as he puts it on the floor, you've got to bring double team help. Paul gets it across. James takes to the rim. And Dwight Howard could not finish. Nice play. And Paul Gasol able to hit. The United States gets it across. Howard with the jump hook. Yes. Mark, he is so effective going right when he gets the ball at the top of the circle area. He builds his rhythm and finds ways to get to the rim or pull up for that jump shot. Hurry up! Gasol, again. That's his first miss of the night. able to reach for it. And the bucket. That's his move there, Mark. Loves to go right. He can score all day long if you let him get to that spot. Nice pass. James able to extend. Yes. The soul again, and the bucket. Two seconds remaining in the quarter. And Chris Paul with the bucket. 
The first quarter is in the books. The Spaniards lead by six. Wow, look at that assist to field goal ratio. That's exactly what coaches want to see. So both clubs have played solid basketball. Oh, you're right, Mark. The offensive execution has been terrific. Both teams getting out in transition. They're moving the ball. They're really setting solid screens. And you're seeing a lot of wide open looks out here. Pretty entertaining first quarter. Gasol, of course, the Spaniard who came over to the NBA as a very touted prospect, and he has not disappointed Marv, a very gifted seven-footer. He has the ability to shoot the ball down on the block or step away from the hoop and knock down the perimeter jumper. And Amari Stoudemire with a nice play. Accelerates and scores. Delivery to James. And LeBron James off the mark. Got to get a better shot than that, Marv. Plenty of time to work with on the shot clock. Got to find some kind of offensive rhythm. The soul to the line. Well, he'll get two free throws here, Marvin. Very important early in the game to establish something from the free throw line. Here's Williams. Rebound by Gasol. Beautiful defensive move. Stoudemire comes up short. Stoudemire looking for the open man. Rejected. And the offensive foul will give it back to the United States. Paul has checked in. That was a three-point attempt. Not a good shot. Well at the half, the Spaniards lead by ten. The Spaniards have to be satisfied with what took place in the first half, but from the coaching point of view, what are the keys to keep this up in the second half? Well, I think any time you've got a comfortable advantage, Marv, you've got to rebound and defend. That's the way to maintain the lead, and that's what I'm looking for in the second half. The Saul in lockdown mode. He fires from downtown. Calderon ends up with it. They've got to use more clock, Marv, work the ball, try to establish some kind of an offensive rhythm. Paul got picked off. It's good! Why do you take a shot from that? That distance! Swarm, I can't believe he pulled up and took that shot. He could have had a much easier attempt at the basket. Navarro trying to stay in front of him. And scores. Gasol with the shot, and Paul Gasol not able to hit, and Jorge Garbavusa not able to hit. The Spaniards control, and Paul Gasol able to put it down. And a foul is called. Anthony has come on. 
Hall gets it back to him. Howard with a layup opportunity. Yes. Calderon setting up. And Carmelo Anthony called for the foul. That's his first. The soul at the line for the first time. And rebounded by Bosch. We're down to the final seconds. Bosch with a quick release. So after three, the Spaniards lead by 12. Well, as we head to the fourth quarter, the home crowd has to be pleased what they have seen to this point. Well, I think so, Marv. Their team has played very well, at least through the first three quarters. But you know, they've got to be careful in this fourth quarter. They've got to continue to take care of the basketball and execute offensively if they're going to maintain this lead. Look out. Good play. Gasol again. And Chris Paul called for the foul. That's his second. And Paul Gasol with 23 points. James fires one up. And the field goal. Well, defensively, that's a poor job there, Mark. You know this guy likes to go left. I mean, that's one of his tendencies. So send him back to the right. Try to get him out of his comfort zone. And Paul Gasol with 24 points. And a foul is called. Gasol has checked in. Bryant on a quick release. The Americans control. And a foul is called. Fernandez rebounds. Yes. Well, if you want to win in the NBA, Marv, you've got to defend. I haven't seen any defense tonight from this club. Paul in three-point territory. And Chris Paul misfires. Does this team even care about winning, Marv? It's just shot after shot. These guys are playing for stats. Is it a contract here for all of them? Stoudemire, able to hustle it down. And LeBron James off the mark. Well, this is how they've fallen behind by so much already, Marv. Too many easy baskets. James again. Air ball. The soul working the point. And gets the friendly roll. For three. The Spaniards have won it. The final score is 34 to 12. Pal Gasol, the high point man, with 24 points. This is Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr. So long from the FIBA World Championships Arena.